guys welcome back to the channel so first of all just log in with your credentials and in the search bar okay just simply click on this agree and continue now in the search bar search for the vertex ai open this thing in new tab now just wait for a second now click on this workbench and if you get any pop-up like enable api so just simply click on that api now here just please wait for a couple of seconds and you will get the option click on this new node now from here click choose the tensorflow and from here choose the 2.8 without gpus click on that now click on this pencil icon just wait for a second now here we have to change the region as given in the lab instruction page so if you just scroll down for me the region is us central one so i am going to make the changes accordingly now click on this machine type and from here just click on that and if you just scroll down you can see e2 standards click on that and from here choose the e2 standard 2 okay like this make sure your machine type must be look like this e2 standard 2 because it's given in the lab instruction also now once you're done with both the configurations simply click on create and just wait for a couple of minutes and your jupyter notebook has been ready to use So as you can see, now click on this uh, open Jupyter lab. Now this is going to take a couple of seconds. So you can do one thing, go back to a lab instruction page and scroll down to the task number two. Okay. Now from here, copy this command, git clone command. Okay. And go back to your cloud shell and just wait for two Jupyter labs to start. So it's done now. Click on this terminal and paste that command which you copy from your lab instruction and hit enter now this is going to take a couple of seconds so please be patient and if we just go back to a lab instructions from here you can just check on which path we have to go okay now just wait for a couple of seconds So as you can see command is executed properly now click on this training folder now click on this self folder now click on this ai platform folder and from here just click on this file now here please pay attention guys so if you are new so for running the command you can use this play icon or you can use shift plus enter before that what you have to check make sure that your kernel must be python 3 okay make sure of that thing now just scroll down till the step number three if you just scroll down here you can see this is a step 2.2 and here is a step number three 
run your training job to cloud now what you have to do just copy your project id copy this project id and here you can see your project id so just make the changes over here like this if you just click over here you will get the option to make the changes now what you have to do just scroll up till here and now click over here now if you want you can just use this play button to running the command or you can use shift plus enter so just what you have to do just run the commands okay i will tell you where we have to stop so just run all this command till here okay here you can see step 3.3 .3, deploy your model to support the prediction so we have to wait until this command get executed how can we check that its command is executed or not so if you just check over here if you just hover over here you can see your kernel is status is busy now and he need to execute 24 cell and he have executed 8 cell till now so just wait couple of seconds and your kernel will be in the ideal state so please be patient and just make sure your laptop will not go, not go for a sleep So as you can see it take one two three seconds okay now if you just check over here this is our job id so just copy this job id okay copy that job id and here just make the changes with your job id like this now again rerun this command so you can use this play icon or you can use the shift plus enter so now what we have to do we have to wait until this job get created properly how can you check that is your job created or not so in dashboard search for the ai platform okay now here if you just scroll down in the marketplace the third option must be ai platform open this thing in new tab wait for a second now click on this go to ai platform click on that now if you just click on this job option here you can see your job is in running state now so if you just click on this so now it's saying that it's running from last one minute now it is going to take at least five to six minutes to complete this job so please be patient until this job get executed properly
so as you can see four minutes took around five minute and 45 second so it not necessary that it only take five minutes sometimes it take five minutes or sometimes it take more than that now go back to your jupiter and make sure that is your jupiter is in ideal state or not from here okay now what you have to do again just come over here just how can you just click on this play button like this or you can just simply use shift plus enter so just hit that till last okay as you can see now if you just scroll over here there is no error but if you face some kind of error so do not worry about that after running this command if you face some kind of error so do not worry about that now what we have to do we have to wait until our model or version get created how can you check that is your model or version is created or not from here you can just check that is it created or not or you can just simply go back to your job now if you just click on this model option wait for a second And here you can see your model has been created now if you just click on this model name senses so here you can see your version is creating now this is going to take a couple of minutes so please be patient and once this thing is done you will done with this lab So as you can see after six after five to six minutes our version has been created now if you just go back to your jupiter as you can see this output you will fail get now just simply go back to your lab instruction scroll back click on this first check my progress second check my progress third check my progress fourth and fifth you will get a score without any issue now it will take a couple of seconds to update the score over here and it's done now, if you have any doubts, please let me know in the comment section, guys. Thanks for watching and have a good day.